morning hi you guys uh we just finished breakfast right now so i kind of want to tidy up the kitchen a little bit before we get the morning started it's not even morning you guys we are waking up kind of late before we get the day started i would say I feel like a little bit good today to the point where I might want to go to the gym. I just get scared because if I go to the gym and then I'm out for the day, it's not good. But then I'm like, okay, I have to start working out, especially because when it comes time to delivering, I want to be strong. When I had SJ, I did work out and I feel like that really helped me with the delivery. So if I don't work out, I'm scared that I'm going to get to the pushing and I'm going to be like weak, you know? The goal is to go to the gym at least to like walk a little bit lift some weights, stretch, get my body moving, girl. It's been like four or five months that I haven't done anything or even possibly more because I didn't go to the gym when I was pregnant. This morning we had pancakes. They were a hit. And I've been drinking a lot more orange juice because apparently orange juice helps you absorb iron in your food. So kind of a good thing because I've been kind of craving it. Se me hace que sabe rico and I feel like it's helping. Maybe we're not gonna make it to the gym today because just from cleaning, ya me sentí encantada. Jokes on me because there's no laundry detergent. Hey guys, we just finished at Target. This is all we got. Como les dije la vez pasada en el otro vlog, literally we just come for what we need and then that's it. We're not doing anything extra. We came to the sections we needed, not looking around. We came with our list and then we're good to go. So we're gonna go back to the house right now because we need to wash um the swim clothes that we typically or that they typically wear to swim he, literal i was doing the laundry and then i was like oh there's literally no virgin so we got everything we needed you know what i was going to tell you guys i think i was trying to be too ambitious with the whole can i look at the baby clothes yeah. okay i think i was trying to be too ambitious with going to the gym girl like i really think that's my goal to eventually get back to the gym but literal i made breakfast and i cleaned a little bit and i was wiped out i need a nap this is my little workout for today walking right here at target oh this is so cute, cute. look that's cute this is so cute that's it yeah yeah viene el frío so oh this is so cute oh my god i love that one <laughs> it's so cute should we take it for you 12 months no he needs a bear so. te gusta papi si yo creo que he needs like 18 months yeah. Te gusta? Bluey! Wow. Okay, maybe we're not just taking what we need. <laughs> we're taking a little more. <laughs> but okay, let's go then so that we can. Oh, matching, how cute. Okay, take it. <laughs> we're gonna get matching for the for the siblings. It is so hot outside, you guys. Estamos, dude, estamos a 98. Really? We're at 98 right now in California, so it's hot outside. I feel like being pregnant in this state is. Sabes que no es, la, no es tanto el calor, es la presión. Like you come outside and you just feel like your whole body's like, you know, like you need a. No necesitas una Coca Cola bien fría. But this trip was a success. Let's get home, wash what we have to wash. Vamos. Yeah, you guys, I can't believe I was really trying to make it to the gym, but it's like my dream to be able to go, to have energy to go again. But it's okay, one step at a time. I know there's a lot of women who have also given birth without working out ever, and they've successfully done it, and they've gotten there, and it's fine. So I'm like, maybe it'll be the same. I just don't want to get to the point of pushing, and then I'm like, 
I have no strength. Vamos a lavar esta ropa. Luego la tenemos que secar. It's SJ snap time, so this is like my time to work, my time to edit, my time to do what I need to do. Gracias, papi. ¿Quieres que lo abra? These are his toys, look. <laughs> ¿Lo abro? ¿Puedes decir por favor? Ok, claro que sí, ¿cómo no? Gracias, de nada. So cute. What? Eso es basura. Papá, ok. My mom is an angel on earth and she knows how difficult cooking is for me. It's not that it's difficult, let me tell you what it is. I was barely learning how to cook when he was eating solids and then, sorry for the noise, and then I got pregnant and then when I got pregnant, the last thing I want to do is think about what we're going to eat, but obviously we still have to eat. So my mom has been an amazing, amazing grandma and she has been helping me so much and sometimes, she, but she's been making extra whatever she eats. So today she made SJ some chicken soup. So we're gonna eat that. She's an angel on earth, you guys. Not grandma, right? Grandma, yes. Grandma. ¿Qué pasó, mi amor? I don't know what it is about grandmas and soup when it's hot, pero nos vas a ver bien rica. ¿Te gusta cómo cocina la abuela? Yeah. Yes. You know what? I will also say I am not the best cook. Like we know that, right? Ma. ¿Qué pasó, mi amor? ¿Te sirvo pollito? Sí. Okay. Um, I'm not the best cook at all whatsoever. So sometimes it would be super defeating when I barely had energy and then I would make whatever and then he wouldn't like it. I would be like, oh my God. He always likes my mom's food. So that's a blessing. That's a blessing. The fact that he likes my mom's food because then we know like, okay, my mom will cook for him. Everything's okay. Sometimes I cook, it's a hit. Sometimes I cook, it's not a hit, but it is very like, oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, se los he dicho mil veces, Dios no me dio ese talento, but I'm trying. And when I'm not pregnant anymore and I have energy again, I'll start trying again. Vamos a comer pollito. Vamos a comer pollito. ¿Estás bien? ¿Estás bien, mi amor? I'm going to show you guys how I like my caldo. So, caldo con arroz. Luego, es de papá. Me gusta echarle limón. También le echo al del Santiago because like, he likes lemon too. When he was younger, he would just eat it like eso. Gracias, mi amor. ¿Listo? Thank you. Then, last step for mine. I like to add tapatío porque me gusta que en Chile. Oh my God, se me está haciendo agua la boca. Al de él, obviamente, no le echo chile. Pero no le puedo echar mucho. Because this pregnancy, como que el chile no me cae muy bien. ¿Ready? Oh, you can get something in his backpack? How look this looks. <gasps> bon appetit! Vamos a comer! Okay. Oh, cut my hair, by the way. Oh, a ver, show us your hair today. Hey, my mommy! Hey! Viene platicando el Santiago con Amy. Apúrale, papi, vete. Yay! ¿Cómo estás? Baby, can you get me my chair? Yeah, no hay oh. donde sentarme, girl. Wow. We brought the lawn chair. <laughs> yeah. Bringing a chair because Amy doesn't have furniture to sit on. Y ni modo que nos sentemos en tu cama. Oh, okay. Thank you. We have outside clothes. Oh, yeah. It looks empty? No. No? Ooh, this is what you are taking? Yeah. Cierra la puerta, ¿verdad? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I am taking. Wow. Hello. You guys are here. <laughs> Hi, everyone. ¿Querías comida para él o comida para él? Oh, I know. I think like it's just... Bravo. Um, and then this one. This is feeling very 2022 vibes. When I used to vlog here. <laughs> Could do it, um... Hey, is this a perro? No, 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 no,
You guys, I didn't tell you, but last time the thing that made my tooth fall out was kava. Hopefully, another one of my teeth doesn't fall out. No, it's like half of my tooth. Oh. I know. This is the Clarissa avocado bowl. Taste test. Is Santiago good with it? Mm. I'm so hungry. Yeah. We put it sideways and most likely we're gonna have mm -hmm. this one. This is good. Oh, you want yeah. it? Tenía hambre because we got our Santiago swimming class. And then we're going directly to the Nice. Oh, good ass. Good ass, Pa. Gracias. He loves to help. He's so cute. There's not a TV in that other box, right? No, we have inside. Cut it. Cut it. Nice. A comer, provechito. Okay. Literally, I feel like before I used to do laundry once a week. Now we do laundry every three days. The more family members, the more laundry we do. Literally, mm, it smells fresh. Guys, it's adios. Today's been a good day, you guys. I got to rest. We got to see my sister, which we've been trying to see her as often as possible now since she's leaving really soon. Today we basically went to her house so that Denny could take down her TVs. Denny, ever since he came into our lives, he's like the man in all of our lives. Like he takes care of everything when we need to do like any heavy lifting or we need to um, like put up TVs or take down TVs. <laughs> so uh, gracias a Dios, we were able to help her take that stuff down. We got to come home and then it doesn't stop here, girl. It is nonstop in this house. I've been reading your comments in my last video where I talked about, about like how I haven't been feeling good and stuff. Y un comentario me llamó la atención más que todos. There was a comment by one of you guys, which shout out to you, girl. The comment basically said like, I'm a surrogate and this is my third pregnancy. So I guess she has two of her own kids and this is her being a surrogate. And she was saying that when you're a surrogate, they just tell you to take so many more things because you're considered high risk automatically since you're a surrogate. I was thinking, like she kind of put everything she's taking there in the comment. And I was like, I wonder why they're not like that with us. You know what I mean? Like, why is it so like, I feel like with pregnancy, they tell you like, it's normal, it's normal, mama. It's normal, you're doing good, you're doing good. Y aquí estamos todas moribundas apenas pudiendo, you know? <laughs> and I feel like they kind of brush it off really easily. Yeah, from what I read in the comments, some of you guys have also not been feeling super amazing. So I'm sorry, you guys, if you can relate to not feeling amazing in your pregnancy, I get you, girl. But I can tell you, yeah, I ended up ordering some grass fed um, liver. ¿Qué más? I don't know, like a bunch of animal, like, I don't know how to say it. It's like beef, grass fed beef organs like it's like in a pill my mom told me about them she's like they say that if you're low in iron if you take these like they'll really really help you so i looked at the reviews and they were amazing so i'm gonna try those pills and see if they help which hopefully they do yeah other than that i feel like i'm feeling a little bit better gracias a dios and by a little bit better i don't really mean like leaps and bounds but we take what we can you know like today we didn't really get up that early and then i Ended up having to take a nap with SJ when he took his nap for the day. So I sleep a lot. But yeah, you guys, ahorita ya me voy a... I'm gonna chill, voy a descansar. I'm gonna watch some Love is Blind UK. By the way, did anybody watch Love is Blind Mexico? Let me know your thoughts down below because what a hot mess. Pero all I can say is que Dios los bendiga. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog here so that I can do this really fast and then we can close out for the rest of the night but thank you guys for hanging out with us so 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 much i hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with us i hope you had fun uh let me know your thoughts comments concerns that's gonna be it for me las quiero mucho 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 que dios me las bendiga quiere mucho respeto más and i'll see you in the next video bye